Hi, my magical friends. It's Jess from My Magical Planner. And I have a little bit of a haul here. Some of this is Black Friday stuff. Well, this the Sweet Kawaii Designs, I'm pretty sure is Black Friday. I think the Simply Gilded might have been the Friday before. And then these two were around that same time period. So let's start with this one that I've kind of ripped into just a little bit. Because I was so excited. I wanted to see if it was what I ordered. So this is, of course, from the Coffee Monster Co. And most of this was bought for my Hobonashi. Um, there might be, like, the skating I'm probably going to use in my regular one. But... All right, we'll set that off to the side. And we'll start with the little thank you. Look at how cute it is. So we have like a little munchkin drinking some hot chocolate. Oh, I love the little bear. And it has him just leaning back against a pillow and playing on the computer. It's snowman saying, just chill out, dude. And then we have, of course, the shopping with add to cart. So next I have some winter munchkins that I got. I was worried they'd sell out by Black Friday. So I have the ice skating on the pond little scene, which I think is adorable. I got these little ones with them like at the computer with a little snowflake on there. It's so adorable. And then these were the Aaron ones. So we have little munchkin with the shopping bag and the car doing like household chores and picking out the trash. And then I also got these little computer guys, which I thought were cute. So we have a reindeer, a little Santa hat guy, a Grinch, a snowman and an elf. So, so cute. And then, okay. So, Hold on. We have two of these, it looks like. I probably ordered two. Oh my gosh, look at how cute that is. This is her freebie little thing. And it's, uh, this is where you collect all of your little coffee beans. And if you collect enough, what do you get? Record date, place an order, and leave a note letting us know that you are redeeming a bean card. Snap a picture of your completed card and email it to us with order number, blah, blah, blah. Um, I'm not exactly sure what you get, but anyhow, you get something. <laughs> and then I got two of these, which are the full year. One of them I'm planning on cutting out and then putting in my Hobonashi, I think, for this coming year. And the other one I might use in my um, Harriet Wright Designs Planner because it doesn't come with a um, overview view of the year. So there are those. And then I did get one of her little Hobo Cousin kits. This is a new chapter, which I thought was adorable and it's all book themed. So we have like little munchkin carrying the books here. We have them reading and look, there's like all this magic coming out of the book. I thought that was so cool. And then we have like these little book scenes here. We have these sticky notes. We have like to do's and this week, plus these little check boxes. And then we have a weekend thing and these bubbles here. We have this little graph, which I thought this was really interesting. And then we have some decorative boxes. We have these little munchkin guys so you can track your mood. Um, we have a busy bee and like the book over here. I've never had one of her hobo kits and I, I really like the layout and what you get. So I might have to get more of them, but that's what I have from Const Coffee Monster Co. And then I think I'm going to do this one next because this is another pretty small order. This one is, I wish I could show you the front. <laughs> Hold on. Maybe I can. Hold on. Let me place stuff kind of over addresses but like it's so so cute and you can kind of see like the little munchkin over here and 
every minute of the story over here. It's so adorable. So let's kind of get into here. Maybe, kind of, sort of. Take it up enough. Okay, fine. We're just gonna slit it right here, really close to the top. I honestly don't remember what I ordered. I think it was all like New Year's type stuff though. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. Um, here we go. It's a really big envelope. So I got some of their vellum. I want to start trying to use the vellum in my planners. I've seen some really cute things. And we'll see if I can get it out of it. Okay, that's it. I always try to be nice and not ruin the bag, but yeah. So this is the vellum sheet that I got. And it's just super cute with all the little Christmas munchkins on it. So let me pull my planner over so I can show you. So I've seen a lot of people using these, especially towards like these type of pages where they'll, sometimes people will put them in between, uh, especially at the beginning or end of a month, or they'll cut out little pieces and put like, say some here for decoration or layering elements, that kind of thing. And it's been really cool to see. So I'm excited to try that out and probably well this will definitely be december but mostly in the new year oh look at how cute that is i always love the freebie cards with journaling cards sorry so i think i have a bunch of die cuts in here for the new year Let's put some of the packaging out of the way so first we have oh this is the journaling prompts that i thought would were amazing. So you have these little icons and then they have little journaling prompts next to them. So you have a place I'd like to visit, I'm looking forward to, top five reminders, a book I'd like to read, I will practice more of, food I want to buy or food I want to try and avoid, a new skill I want to learn, I want to spend more time with, a bad habit going to break. I want to be better at. So these are all like kind of reflections, end of year, beginning of new year type thing. And then here are her, <laughs> these are all of the holidays for the year. And so we have like, there's Father's Day, um, Valentine's Day. Is Mother's Day on here? Did they miss Mother's Day? Oh, Mother's Day's there. Sorry. Black Friday's here. Cinco de Mayo. Happy birthday. And then we have Hello Winter. Hello Fall. Hello Spring. Hello Summer. Super cute. I got these little therapy guys because they were super cute. Oh, these are all the die cuts right there. And these are more of those reflection journaling prompts. So we have this one. This went well this year. Um, favorite book of the year. So the other one was more like the looking forward and these are the more looking back. This drained my energy, most memorable day of the year, biggest lesson learned, favorite show or movie of the year, thankful for, biggest challenge of the year, one word to describe the year, an achievement I'm proud of this year. So super cool. And this is like the, it says new year, new dreams. And so it's all of the 2022 kind of new year's Eve type stuff. I love this little new year's and this little guy like up there and the little party down here. It's just super cute. 
I did get the little bookmark thing that has bell on it. I probably am not going to use this as a bookmark. I thought it would make really cute deco in my, my planner. So I have that. I have the little 2022 guys. I think this is the freebie. So we have, oh, this seems really cute. And just some little guys drawing and doing things more like Valentine's Day, maybe. Um, life is tough, my darling, but so are you. I thought this was cute. And then cre creator of my own happy life. A very good reminder. And deep breath, girl, you got this. Another very good reminder. I'm planning on doing a vision board. So some of those are for my vision board. So that's actually going to be a collaboration coming up in January. I think it's going to be January 10th. That's what we were talking about today. Okay. So next I'm going to do this one. This is my sweet kawaii designs order. And I ordered a lot of things to try out. And it, I love her packaging and how cute it is. <laughs> I mean, all the little guys. And then you open it up and everything's all packed nicely in like a little envelope for you. And then, so this is my receipt, which is more than one page. Yeah, we won't think about that. <laughs> and all my stickers are in here. Just, just one or two things, you know. So let me see, where do I want to start? Um, I'll do that one last, I think. Let's do the kit. Okay, so this is a Christmas kit. She has the like peanuts um, Christmas stuff, which is adorable. So she's, I think it's on her list of things that are going to be going away soon. So I went ahead and picked it up. So we have like Snoopy, the little bird guy, his dog house, this Christmas tree, and the iconic Charlie Brown Christmas tree. These are just a really light tone, beautiful coloring. And then here are the big boxes. And we have, you know, to do's, day off. $2 Tuesday and freebie Friday because she always does those. This one says, I just want my fair share. And this one is maybe it just needs a little love. Super cute. And then we have a couple more boxes. I especially love this scene <laughs> where she has psychiatric help, five cents. The doctor is in. And then we have happy holidays here. These are really cute too. And then these are her decorative boxes. I love these ones. I think it's really cute. So I think this must be an older kit for her. And you have your numbers down here. There's your date headers. And there's your bottom washi. So that's the Charlie Brown one. And So here is, oh, Introvert New Year's Eve. That's what it was called. <laughs> and when I saw this kit come out, because I think she released it on Black Friday. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's so me. I am not a party person. So I enjoy getting together with friends, but in small groups. <laughs> in a big group, I'm totally lost and overwhelmed. So those are your checklist, your weekend, and these are your headers. And then here are your decorative boxes. I love this one. And I partied hard. This is your year to sparkle. New year, same mess. <laughs> Kiss me at midnight. Midnight's crossed out at 9 p.m. I've got to go to bed. Happy new year. The dumpster fire <laughs> of 2021. <laughs> Which I don't know if anybody else has felt like the last two years. Yeah, not so good. <laughs> and then we have a um, I Survived 2021 badge here. <laughs> and this guy's my favorite. I can't remember his name though. 
Is it Fred? It might be Fred. I could be wrong. If anybody knows, put it down below. But I I really like these little, especially the balloons. And then we have our decorative boxes. And here's our bottom washi and our gate covers. After that, I think the other big thing I got is so I have signed up for the Sweet Kawaii subscription. So she does both a Sweet Kawaii, which is kind of a complete um, random type kit. And then she does monthly subscriptions. And this is most of them monthly. I think it's missing the big cart or like the big sticker, but has everything else you would get in the monthly subscription. So at least I think that's the case. And both subscriptions are about $25. So if you really like this, I'm going to link her down below and you can go and check it out. But there is something nice about the monthly kits just coming and knowing that you'll have it. I was concerned that getting both of them would be too much um, sticker wise. And then I'd end up just having too many stickers in general. So she always does a sheet of the wacky holidays. And I think she must like look these up or something. Cause they're like, none of them are <laughs> like well, us Martin Luther King junior day is there, but the next one is like the, th the Saurus day. And the 23rd is handwriting day, peanut butter day, <laughs> Irish coffee day. <laughs> so they're just all kinds of random fun things. And then here are your this week's and all your headers. And I love these colors. And then you have the Hello January, which I think this might have been the big sticker, but I could be wrong. I love these little snowflake banners. You have bill dues and like little TVs and all of your Monday through Sundays here. I think this is supposed to be enough stickers for the whole month. So you have all of your checklist here. And then you have a full page of half, um, half box boxes. And then here are your full boxes. Oh, I love this one so much. The small steps every day. Oh, maybe that was the, the full size sticker. It might've been, I don't know. And then we have stay cozy and they're sledding and the snow glow. Enjoy the little things in life. I mean, it's just super cute. And then we have a full page of icons. Love this one and this one. Well, honestly, I love them all. Look, you get a little snowman. And this is me on laundry day. And just all the things that you really need. Then you have your habit trackers, your smaller boxes, and your weekends. And then you get another page of full size boxes. Look how cute this one is. It's so adorable. Oh. And this one says good Monday. And it says tis the season to be freezing. That's every time we go to the rink. <laughs> and then you get a full page of your day headers and of course your date dots to go with them. And then you get two pages. Of, hold on. Oh, nothing important. Happy planners having a sale. <laughs> and then you get all of this bottom washing, which I think this is so pretty. And I love these little boxes here. So there is, I think that's all my kits. And then this is mostly random stuff. So, all right. A lot of jumbo stickers, I think. And like some other type of formats that I wanted to see how I liked before I ordered tons of them. I feel like this might be the freebie. Because I don't know that I ordered all of that. But maybe I did. I could have. I got the small steps every day card. This is like such a great reminder. Oh, I love it. And yep, there's your thank you. So I got these and these are supposed to, I believe, go for the back. Um, pull up a page. And you can do like this here and layer some other things around it kind of thing. So some people use one of these and then they'll pull in these boxes as well. So you can like 
do different layering techniques and have different things in the back. And then she also has these ones. So I just wanted to kind of try it out and see what size boxes I enjoy using and what ones work for me in the back or if none of them work for me. <laughs> Look at January too. I think I ordered this. I'm not positive. Oh, and I totally ordered these because when I saw them, I was like, yes, this is my life. It says chaos coordinator <laughs> with four kids. It's totally my life. <laughs> and these, I think, are all my jumbo stickers that I ordered. So we have interrupt anxiety with gratitude. We have don't worry. <laughs> don't worry. You're just as sane as I am. This is from Luna Lovegood, and I adore Luna. And then we have, of course, that scene that I really loved from Snoopy. I'm going to have so much fun decorating with them. All right, I'm going to move this back off to the side. And here's our little freebie, guys. So we get the turkey again, and we get the little hedgehog again, and all of, like, the mushroom and the little, um, like, Dutch oven guy. This is, she puts this in all of hers. It's just a reminder that regular, like, gel ink pens will not write on her paper. She used, she says to use a permanent marker or a ballpoint pen so that it doesn't smear. It's a really awesome thing that she includes that as a reminder. And then in here, it looks like we get a little ornament or something. Oh, there's like two little strings. And there's two ornaments. Hold on. Come here, little string. Okay, so we have a sparkly string. We have this little guy who is iridescent and so, so cool. We have a really cool washi card. Oh, they're gift tags. So we have to and from with the little penguins and then this little guy. And then here's our little postcard or journaling card. So, so cute. And then our last little freebie is this one that says, um, you're serious, Clark. That's a TV reference that I don't know. Oh, fudge, stink, stink, stunk. That would be great to go in next to the dumpster fire. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Merry Christmas, you filthy animal. Oh, I love that movie. Um, so the nice thing about these is like the little freebies are actually on sticker paper. So after you use the middle stuff, you can kind of cut this out and then use it as a frame in your picture, like on your, your planner and put something else in there and use it. And I've seen some really cool things people have done with these. So that's everything from Sweet Kawaii Designs, which leaves us with... My order from Simply Gilded. Oh, okay. Um, wait, which side? Okay, I think it opens on this side, but all the stuff I think is over there. So I'm just gonna try and slit it super close to the edge here. Okay. So I don't have a huge order here because I, I, I've ordered several times this month, so I didn't need a ton of stuff, but I did go and pick up some albums. So I got, okay, we'll go with this one first. I really want to get the big one of this, but I think it was sold out. So I just, I settled for the little one. And it's just, it's this light blue with these really cute snowflakes on it. And um, it's almost like a white pearl or maybe a silver pearly type color. And then of course the inside is white. I have a big sticker organization on the horizon <laughs> because uh, I may have ordered a few stickers on Black Friday. We're not talking about how much I spent but we'll just say it's not a small sum. <laughs> so, and then she released these, I 
think, along with these washies. So, let's see here. And now I'm trying to remember if this is Black Friday or like her Black Friday sale or if it was the one before. I may have another order coming. <laughs> I can't remember, guys. So bad. Anyhow, but it's like this galaxy and I thought it was so pretty with the blues and the purples and the inside's kind of a silver color. And then I have the matching bigger one, which is just really cool. So these, the smaller ones work great for, you know, the, like the $2 Tuesday type sheets or the one fourth size sheets like this size. Um, they work amazing in here. The bigger albums fit most five by seven kits. I think simply while your colors co makes hers a little taller. And because these are side loading, it, those ones don't fit in here, but for the most part, everybody else fits in here. So I'll take, here's a sweet Kauai designs five by seven sticker and they fit in perfectly. I know some people also use these as photo albums or they convert them to like planner covers. I think it is so, but they work great for that. I've also had one of these that I put the stickers in side by side like this, um, just cause I didn't have enough room. So and I had more of the bigger ones than the smaller ones. Anyhow, and then here is my new washi which you know <laughs> i had a little bit of a problem guys so th this was i think she had some firework washi that i really wanted so we have a happy new year's card which is really pretty i love the the white it did get a little bent in the mail but that's okay and then we have a perfectly red little bow here. Here's our freebie with the fireworks. Yay. And like the hollow is kind of this broken gold. It's so cool. And then I have a white sheet. Oh, these are little cats. Oh my gosh, guys, you got to see this. Hold on. Where are my, where are my tweezers? Tweezers. Oh, there they are. I knew they were here, but oh my gosh, you got to see this. Like she always has hearts. I've never seen another shape. And they're little cats. How adorable is that? Oh, those are going to be so popular. I don't remember if I ordered these or if these are a freebie. Yeah. Yeah. We're not talking about it. Okay. So these are the fireworks washi that I really, really wanted. And then these are, I think they were last year's Christmas floral. And I think this is a freebie because I have another one of this washi. So I am not going to open this one, but I will swatch out these other ones real quick and then show you some close ups. All right, here are those four washi. So it's very subtle, but I love this one with the poinsettias and the little gold bows in there and having it at both the 15 and 10 is super pretty and then I have the white and black versions of the fireworks which I'm hoping to use with a new year's eve spread I think are amazing look at how the gold one at the top just shimmers and then it's a little harder to see on the white one I think through the camera but it does a similar thing so all right. Oh, and I'll show you what this one looks like. So that is this washi right here. And I just, I think I'm going to put this aside and uh, maybe not until the new year or maybe closer to Christmas. We'll do another getaway and I'll include this. So that's everything I have for today. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button over there for more planning videos. Until next time, I'll see you guys real soon.